before I say anything, I just want to say my prayers go out to Kobe, his family, his wife, his kids. Today's a weird day because uh, today I had planned to post a YouTube video. Um, and then this news hit and I said there's no way I can continue to post this. It's crazy how quick life can be taken from you. Like the cliche saying, you never know when it's your last day. I'm, just, I'm literally just lost for words, man. Um, I just want to say Kobe inspired me, inspired a village of kids who grew up, you know, yelling Kobe, shooting the trash cans, wanting to be just like you. Necessarily, I never looked at Kobe as one of my favorite players. I looked at him as an icon to all. Like, he was on a different level, and I respect him as a person because the way he was with his family and the way he gave advice to his peers. I, I, then I looked at LeBron, who is following in his footsteps by playing with the Lakers, passing Kobe literally yesterday, the most points scored of all time, being third on the list. And this happens today, it's just, doesn't make sense. Doesn't make sense, man. I just want to pay homage to Kobe in this video by first going through. I have a lot of his shoes that I've, I tend to wear in a lot of my videos, and each one has a significant story. So I'm going to go ahead and go through them. So I remember this pair of shoes right here. I believe it was 2016. My boy gifted me these because he didn't want them no more. He gave them for free. These are my first pair of Kobe's in my YouTube era. I remember hooping in college knees, wearing these in my videos. And then these right here literally might have been three or four days ago, this is the last hoop shoe I wore in a video, in Foreign Boys video, we did a musical chairs challenge, and these are the shoes I wore, and it was Kobe's first ever shoe model. The, the first pair of Kobe's that I bought with my own money was in Charlotte, uh, All-Star Weekend, his draft day, Kobe 4's, 96, and then these right here, I wore these in a lot of videos, I've worn these in over at least 20 plus videos. I remember the first time I wore these in the gym in a video we played the minorities in a 2v2 and um, just something about whenever I have a Kobe shoe on something great happens or something super hilarious tends to go down. Champs gave these to me to give away and I ended up wearing these almost every video. NBA Live event for NBA Live 19, the game that I was in they gave us all these shoes to play in for that 3 on 3 tournament. So when I was 12 or 13 I played for this team called the Yellow Jackets. And the, the younger team had these, I think, in the black and yellow version. But I seen one of the parents on that team have these in the exact color. And since I was that age and as a kid, I always wanted this pair of shoes. So as I got older and it's retro, I made sure I got my hands on it. Um, that's why I don't wear these shoes a lot. Like, you, you never really see these in a video because these mean a lot to me because these were the one Kobe's that I've always wanted. And these right here, these are very special because I wore these shoes for my birthday video when I turned 24. When I did 24 crazy layups for my 24th birthday, I had these on my feet. My two favorite Kobe's, the undefeated pack. These right here, I've probably wore these more than any shoe I have basketball wise because of the colorway and the comfort and just the look of them. These are the shoes I wore in my 1 million subscriber video, so these definitely mean a lot to me. I've really worn them since that. And Lastly, this hoodie, it says 823, which happens to be his birthday. I had made this hoodie about a couple of years ago when I was in college, and I never gotten rid of it. I've gotten rid of a lot of hoodies, but never this one. And I'm never gonna get rid of this hoodie ever, as long as I live, so. Kobe Bryant, you inspired me, and your legacy will forever live on. I will do my part in, in making sure that, you know, I acknowledge you in the sports world as one of the greatest, if not the greatest of all time, and to continue to wear your brand in all my videos for the rest of the year. Tell your loved ones you love them every day because you never know where they're gonna go. When you leave the house or the store or anything, tell your loved ones that you do love them because you never know when's the last time you're gonna see them. And, and this is living proof of that. And as well as his 13 year old daughter, Gigi. Rest in peace to her as well. Show love to your loved ones. Don't take life for granted. That's all I gotta say. I'm out of here, man.